I mean, next thing you know, it just sounded like a bomb went off. David and Monique, both 29, best friends since high school, had only lived in this house on Charlevoix for six days when this happened on April 10th. Yeah, his wheels were in the basement, his front wheels. I'm so happy he lived, it was miraculous. The driver of the white Jeep told me he's feeling better, but doesn't remember much about the crash. Police closed the case. Just, just looking at it now, it was just so surreal, I'm lost for words. I've never been this close to it, actually. They took the whole porch. Stop it. Nine days later, David and Monique can't believe it. What damage the Jeep didn't do, vandals stole everything inside the home, their dream home, and where they worked, a total loss. We had everything going for us because the biggest, the thing that was holding us back before as a company is that we didn't have a house. The 1,800 square foot home, originally built in 1912, deteriorated throughout the years and eventually became a land bank home. Because we'd never owned a home before and we thought this is the best place to start building, a, building our life in Detroit. The home purchased in December of 2020 and compliance with land bank rules was achieved in October 2022, using all the money they earned from their company. So the Euphoric Tree Fort, we sell Smell-O-Vision candles. Um, Smell-O-Vision? Yeah, so the idea is that you would take a, take one of our candles. We have over 70 different scents, ranging from anything from Harry Potter to Quentin Tarantino movies. And the idea is that you burn it during the show or movie for a 4D experience. And the candle business, gone. A GoFundMe account has been set up. We'll put a link on our website, fox2detroit.com. You, uh, you know, my dad said something to me I'll never forget. He said, you find out how strong you are when your back is against the wall, so. Is your back against the wall? Oh, definitely, but I'm, make, I'm making the best out of it. We're making the best out of it, and um, I don't, you know, I think, I think everything will be fine. On Detroit's east side, Charlie Langton, Fox 2 News.